Hi, question number nine taken from June 2002, advanced level maths HSC P3. The complex number 1 plus i root of 3 is denoted by u. Express u in the form of o cos theta plus i sin theta, where o is greater than 0 and minus pi less than theta less or equal to pi. Hence or otherwise, find the modulus and the argument of u square and u cube. Okay, for the first part. <laughs> We have the complex number u is equal to 1 plus i root of 3. So we need to find the, uh, we need to express it in the polar form. Polar form r cos of theta plus i sine of theta. I'm sure you should know what is this. Now, this is basically a right angle triangle. And that's the opposite. I got i root of 3 and uh, the edge set which is 1. Here yeah, this is uh, the imaginary part and that's the real axis. <clears throat> so uh, where do we go from here? We can find theta. So I'm going to say tan inverse of um, opposite of a edge set root 3 over 1 and that's going to give us theta. And what is tan root 3? And that's going to be theta is going by pin 3. So this is the argument, all right? Or shall I say the angle, all right? And then we need to find r. And here we are, r. So for r is equal to, by using Pythagoras theorem, 1 to the square plus the root of 3 to the square. And you do the square root of that, and you're going to get the square root of 4, and that's going to give you 2. Therefore, the answer is um, a u is equal to 2 times cos of pi upon 3 okay plus i sine of pi upon 3 here we are for this part of the first part also we need to find the mod of u square but first of all we need to evaluate u square so that's uh, sorry 1 plus i root of 3 times 1 plus i root of 3. This is basic quadratic expansion. So where do we go? 1 times 1 is 1. I root 3 times 1. I root 3 times 1. So that's plus 2i root of 3. i times i is i square. So plus i square. Root of 3 times root of 3 is 3. Okay, so I've got 1. i square is minus 1. Minus 1 times 3 is minus 3. So I've got minus 3. Okay, then we have to add to 2i root of 3. So 1 minus 3 is minus 2 plus 2i root of 3. Okay, so that's the other part. So this is u square. So what is the mod of u square then? The mod of u square is going to be 2 to the square minus 2 to the square is 4 plus 2 to the square is 4 plus the root 3 to the square is 3. Uh, 3. 3 times 4 is 12. It's going to give us a root of 16, and that's going to be 4. And the argument of u square is going to be the um, opposite over the edge side. So that's inverse tan of uh, 2 root of 3 over 2 of minus 2. And that's going to give us inverse tan of minus root 3. And that's basically 2 the three because here is the angle mm, minus root three is this part so this angle here right so this is the argument of u square what about the argument of u cube so we have got these two four so the next one mod of u cube is going to be two to the power of three which is eight <coughs> and this one it was first pi and 3, then we have 2 pi and 3, now we're going to get pi. So therefore the argument of u cube, so not the more argument of u cube is pi. These are the answers. Okay, for the second part, we need to show that u is a root of z square minus 2z plus 4 is equal to 0. So, what we should realize is that 
if you have a quadratic equation, maybe you can say um, z is equal to alpha, that's the first root, and z is equal to beta, that's the second root. So where do we go from here? So z minus alpha times z minus beta is equal to zero. And what is alpha? Alpha is the root, and the root was given as 1 plus i root of 3. So I'm going to say z minus, uh, in brackets, 1 plus i root of 3. Okay, then close brackets. And z minus, the other root would be 1 minus i root of 3. Close brackets. So if you multiply these, then uh, you're going to you're going to have to reach a certain stage where you can prove it. Okay, so how are we going to multiply this? So what I'm going to do, z times z is z squared. Okay, z times this whole thing here, plus z times minus, is minus z, times 1 minus i root of 3. <coughs> okay, then I've got uh, z times minus is minus z. Okay, inside I've got i, 1 plus i root of 3 and you got minus times minus is plus and you can multiply these this one is plus this one is minus so difference of 2 square I got then uh, 1 times 1 is 1 plus times minus is minus okay i times i is i square then root 3 times root 3 is 3 Go to zero. So, sorry about that. I'm trying to get some space and make it more convenient here. So I got z square minus z times one is minus z minus z times one is minus z minus two z minus z times plus sorry minus times minus is plus i root of three z. <coughs> I got uh, minus z times this is minus plus is plus minus, sorry, minus uh, then i root of 3 z and then, <coughs> sorry, plus 1 minus i, i is minus 1, minus 1 times 3 is minus 3, minus minus 3 is equal to 0. So I've got then z square, so these cancels out plus minus, minus 2 z, okay, 1 plus 3 is 4. Here we are, shown. This is shown, has been shown here. z square minus 2z plus 4 is equal to 0. z square minus 2z plus 4 is equal to 0. Okay, for the third part, we need to sketch an organ diagram. Sketch an organ diagram. Here's your real axis. Here's your imaginary axis. And you need to show and uh, shade this region. Z minus I. The mod of Z minus I is less or equal to 1. And the argument of Z greater than the argument of U. Argument of Z greater or equal to argument of U. Okay, so let's go back. This is what? A circle minus I. Less or equal to 1. <coughs> That's the center. Center here is 0, 1. So we got here 0, 1. This is the center and this is the radius. So the radius is 1. Therefore, what are we going to have? So this is 1, 1, 1. So 1, 1, 1. So your circle is going to be a little bit like. So this is your circle. Then I got this argument of z. And this is greater or equal to argument of u. We found earlier in the first part argument of q was pi up and 3. So from here, if this is going to be pi up and 3. It's going to be greater, meaning it is above the line and within the circle. So we're going to shade this region. And here we are for the third part of the question. Okay. I hope you've uh, been able to make sense out of this.